Hello everybody, my name is Harvey Du from Draytech Australia. Today I will guide you through the installation of bigger ACS2 software, Windows 64-bit version. Open the software folders and launch the Java application. Click next. Click next, next again, and then install. The installation will take a few minutes. Click finish to end the installation and then launch the Maria database. Click next. Accept the terms. Click next. Next again. Enter root password. Confirm it. Enable access for, from remote machines and use the default sub character set if you want. Click next. Install as a service by default. Click install and let go. Again, this will take a few minutes. Now, click on finish to uh, end the installation of the Maria database. We will now install the proper ACS2 software. Run the setup. Use the local database or remote one depending on where you want. Use the folder where the Maria database is uh, saved. Click next. Now you can upgrade the database or rebuild a new one. We will rebuild a new one. Next, we put the root password, confirm it again, and then we'll be check on the password. Very important. We do that and it accepts it. Click next to use the default settings and install it. Create a desktop shortcut and then next. The software will take about 15 to 20 minutes depending on your server and it will ask for a key to continue. Press the key and that's finished. Now we will launch the ACS2 server. We type in the IP address of the server or localhost. Then we log in as root, the password, and put the validation code. Remember, you will be allocated a 30 days trial period. You then log in using your MyVig account and password. Then give it a nickname. database and then you click on the trial version you will be requested to accept the terms and conditions and then you register log into SCS now your server is ready. Login as root, the password, and the validation code. This concludes the bigger ACS2 installation. Thank you for your attention.